A youth detention centre on the central coast, north of Sydney, remains in lockdown after a group of detainees reportedly used chainsaws to cut open their cell doors, sparking a riot. Christy Kulcher is outside the Carryong Juvenile Centre for us this morning. Christy, a number of detainees remain on the roof. That's right, Peter. You can probably just see over my shoulder here on this roof, there's probably at least half a dozen, if not more, inmates on the roof there. They're armed with makeshift uh, weapons. There's tools, there's tennis rackets, there's poles, there's, there's sticks, and they're using those to bash around on the roof and throw them at the riot squad that are down the bottom here trying to get them down. We've seen about four of them taken down over the past a few hours, but it's been a long night for the inmates, for the uh, staff here and for emergency services. It all started at around 8.30 last night when uh, some inmates managed to get the keys to a workshop and bust in there and steal some tools. They then used those tools to get their other inmates out of their cells and run riot. As uh, this has unfolded, there's been a string of injuries. There's at least a dozen people that have been taken to hospital, a couple with some serious stab wounds and others with broken broken bones among other injuries. It's still very much an unfolding situation. All the roads around this area have been closed and I'll uh, bring more to you as it comes to me. Christy Kulcher watching over that story for us this morning. Thank you, Christy.